All right, as outrage grows over New York City Mayor Eric Adams handing out free prepaid debit cards to illegal immigrants and the 180 some odd million that he's now allocating towards, you know, more hotel rooms, the mayor decided to set the record straight today at a hearing in Albany and let the world know that's exactly what he's doing. Take a look. There's one thing I learned in New York. New York New York is a very opinionated and they share their thoughts. And so first we want to dismiss the mis, uh, misinformation. Uh, we're not giving people American Express cards. We found that the food delivery service that we set up during the emergency, we could find a better way to do it in our belief that we want to cut 20% of the migrant costs. So we have a pilot project with 500 people that we are giving them a food card. So instead of a debit card, instead of having to deliver food and have people eat food that we were seeing waste in food, they are now able to get their own food that is going to be spent $12 a day. And 500 people get 53 million? That's not all. A couple of days ago, Adams decided that it was a good time to brag about his staff's diversity. He did it in his own way. Take a look. Stand up, stand up. They need to see you. Deputy Mayor Williams Ison, Deputy Mayor Mira Josie, Deputy Mayor Amazar, Deputy Mayor Maria Torres Springer. Have you ever seen this much chocolate leading the city of New York? And then go down the line. Look, look who's here. This is representative of the city. That's why people are hating on me. Oh, that's why the Fannie Willis defense. Anyway, joining us live, he's on the streets of New York City. Former mayoral candidate Curtis Sliwa is with us. Uh, so, okay, uh, he likes chocolate over vanilla. It sounds like, sounds a little like Louis Farrakhan to me there. Uh, $53 million in debit cards for 500 people, on top of $180 million for more hotel rooms uh, in New York, uh, on top of the $1 billion that Biden has given people that enter our country illegally. Uh, and we saw what happened to the people on tape beating the hell out of two police officers. Curtis, things getting better in New York City? Absolutely not. In fact, uh, that's why I'm his number one hater. Join the Curtis Lee Haters Club of Eric Adams, who is single-handedly destroying this city by giving illegal aliens everything. They arrive in our city, imagine, you check into your hotel, you get concierge service, and bam, you get a $1,000 debit card that you can use for the whole month. And you get more money than any veteran, any homeless person, any emotionally disturbed person in New York City gets. That's an absolute outrage. And this mayor just doesn't seem to get it. He takes care of the illegal aliens and forsakes his own people, especially the African-American poor and impoverished who elected him mayor of the city of New York over me, Curtis Lee. Yeah. Well, by the way, if you divide 53 million by 500, that's a $106,000 debit card. Not a bad deal. I don't think they're giving them to, to vets that are homeless in New York City. Not that I've heard, Curtis. Well, in fact, our guys have just taken down one of the migrant guys right here on the corner, 42nd and 7th, while all can, this is Can you is pan taken. the camera? They've taken over. They've taken over. You'd like the camera over there if at all possible. Yep. Oh, you got your key open, guys. He is out of control. Out of control.